Goodbye, creepy guard. I'm going to the back of the library with this adventurous librarian. <laughs> we shall take care of this taxman for you, kitten. Count on Brandar. Where can I find more information about him? Perhaps you know. Census and Excise is the Imperial Agency that collects taxes and tariffs. Hmm. Perhaps they have uh, an office somewhere that I could go visit. Kitten! Pardon me, friend. What is your trade? Jadanir has no trade. Jadanir has the sugar. What does Jadanir need with trade? Just go away! Leave Jadanir alone! Hmm. Not in the best mood, is he? Storage. Oh my. Wow, wrong weapon for the job. I need my icicle. Oh, this isn't quite some disrepair. I should like to get my sword repaired quite soon. Wah! But it will still do the job for these little fellows. Ah, a little bit of gold. To line my pockets. I do enjoy it. Scrimping and saving and making a giant pile. Ah. Anyways, friends. Once I uh, got in with the Bandari battlers in my teenage years, things changed quite a bit. That is where I picked up the habit for Skuma. Not a bad habit overall, as long as you keep it in check. You cannot indulge too much. Your mind might tell you some things. Summon Bonewalker. Ooh, my. That is a nice amulet. But many things about my life uh, should remain hidden, perhaps. You know me to be a bit of a an addict, perhaps. At least you do now. Hopefully you will not see that side of me too often. I go through great lengths to keep it in check. And so far, through most of my life, I have done well enough. Hmm. Potions and gold. Potions and gold. I do need to get some more Undusis Unhinging. Perhaps this would help me in my travels. But for now, just so many goodies. My goodness. Oh. I hear some banging around. Perhaps it is the tax man, hmm? Tax man! I'm here for you! She will tell me nothing. Hmm. I shall take care of this problem for my friend, my kitten. Nobody seems to know where he is. Or at least nobody wants to tell me where he is. Hmm. If I join the temple, perhaps I could infiltrate further. But I'm willing to bet the taxman will be in the, the highest reaches of this place. Sitting atop his throne of gold, hmm? Uh, I want to know where to find these people. Tanners and miners? Perhaps he's taxing the tanners. Citizen. Hello, Naldrassi. Perhaps you can tell me some things? Who is Drambaro? I don't know where he lives, but I've seen him on top of St. Olms before. On top of St. Olms, just as I suspected. I think this... Drum Barrow is who we need to speak to. How about alleviating our friend Atnasi from her tax troubles? <laughs> and this giant floating rock, my goodness. I should like to uh, have a look at what is at the top of there. But perhaps a little later. I have much business with the tax man. St. Ong's Plaza. 
Hello to you! Seen him on top of St. Olm's. Are we not at the top? Somebody enlightened me. Hmm? Not sure why. I think this name is the right one. It sounds right to me. Upper South One. Upper, you say? Hmm. Hmm. It's on top of St. Olm's. This is what people keep telling me. Okay. I'm not sure where I am. This city is so large. And I've been turned around, apparently. Upper North one. Oh my. And the locked door. Randar does not like this. Hmm. Perhaps, perhaps. Hall of Wisdom. Yes, indeed. How about Rambero? Argonians. Argonians are cunning savage beasts incapable of, of enlightenment. They're blasphemous travesties of nature with unspeakable foulness in their private and family urges. When guided by a stern hand, they can be trained as passable servants and slaves. By imperial law, free Argonians have the rights of citizens, but no law can ever make an Argonian human. Wow, Mr. Gallus. You're housing quite some anger there. That's unfortunate. Just because he has a tail doesn't mean he's not human. Well, yes it does, but... <laughs> not being human does not make us less, you see. Ah, there is another Argonian this way. Perhaps you will be more inclined to talk to me, hmm? Yes, help me find someone. All sorts of people live in St. Holmes. I've, I've seen this, yes. Minister of Truth is a celestial body suspended by Vivek's mighty power over the Great Temple of the High Fane in Vivek City. Ugh. <sighs> Nobody knows. Nobody knows about the tax man. Well. At least I do have some sort of direction. But perhaps I should go back to try and find the Hall of Wisdom. Nobody can give me information where this tax fellow located. It's a simple question, really. I don't understand why you want to keep such secrets from Brandar. Know that eventually I will find out. And then the price will be paid for your secrecy. Hmm. Lots of water. Do not want. So that is the place where Adonasi is hiding. How does it look any different from any of the others? I would say that it does not at all. <laughs> uh, but no matter. I think this is the temple quarter. Or close to it. And I should like to go back and find the, uh, the Hall of Wisdom, as it were. Oh, this is Redoran. Not good, not good. The sense of direction has not improved with time, as, uh, as I hoped it had in my earlier days of traveling. I figured I would get used to this, but this is just madness. Everything here looks the same. Water's coming from the walls. They even have these people who make a profit off of being so confused. Oh, kitten! Yes, I know you are female. Oh, so much you can do for me. But for now, we'll uh, stick with the trip to the temple section, please. Thank you so much. Wondrous well. So glad the boat didn't tip over. It's just so wet here. Hmm. Hall of Wisdom. Hall of Wisdom is what I need. Is the Hall of Wisdom inside the Hall of Justice? I, I cannot understand. 
I simply cannot. Ah, here we are. I was so close, yet so far. Midar Aravel, are you looking for services in the sacred city? Hmm, perhaps not. What is the name of this person I am looking for? Hmm, uh, hmm. Mera Milo. That is a close name, not quite. How about you, down here? End of the hall, hello, what is your name? Oh, you are rude. You are just rude. Delmin Halas. Hmm. Do you, do you know this Mera Milo? She works in the library. If she's not there, you might find her in her private quarters. Her door is across from the cannon offices here in the Hall of Wisdom. Cannon offices. Library. This is very good. We are getting pretty good at hunting these people down. Not in such a bad fashion. <laughs> We just hunt them for their own good. I want nothing, nothing, nothing. I love wisdom. Hmm. This does not seem correct. Perhaps it was the door across. Hmm, cannon quarters. Is that what I want? Maybe library. Oh, hello to you, Mera Milo. Yes, I'm a friend of Caius. Perhaps he's told you about our adventures where we put a blanket over ourselves and we crawl around in the dark with both of our shirts off and we kind of rub each other and then fall asleep next to each other. Whoa! I was in the middle of a story. It wasn't a particularly good story. I do apologize for that. Um, but I do have a, que a question or two for you, if you would enlighten me. Guys, sent you follow me to the back of the library. We can't talk here. Wonderful. Goodbye, creepy guard. I'm going to the back of the library with this adventurous librarian. <laughs> oh, goodness, kitten. You've got something about confined spaces, hmm? Come here. Come here. A little closer with Brandar. Yes. Now we talk. In each other's arms. Looking into each other's eyes. Or not. Goodbye, kitten. Kitten! Look at me. Oh, I like to look into your eyes. Oh. Go ahead. I'm afraid I don't know anything about a six house cult, but I can tell you about the Nerevine cult. I do know quite a bit about it, but uh, feel free to tell me more. The temple worships Nerevar as a saint and a hero, but the prophecies of his incarnation are punished as wicked hearsay. The Nerevine cult cl claims the tribunal are false gods, hence the tri temple's persecution of the Nerevine cult. A group called the Dissident Priest disputes Temple Doctrine on the Nerevine Prophecies. The prescribed book Progress of Truth describes their beliefs. Get a copy of Progress of Truth for Caius Cassades. That'll tell him the things he needs to know about the Nerevine cult. Well, I did see this book in Jobasha's. Uh, what do you know about the Dissident Priests? Just offhand. The Dissident Priests dispute Temple Doctrine and are outlawed and persecuted by the Temple. Ordinators arrest and imprison heretics, and the Empire cannot interfere. Progress of Truth lists their beliefs. In brief, they challenge the purity and divinity of the Tribunal, suggesting their powers are sorcerous, not divine, and perhaps akin to the powers of Dagothur. They also condemn the arbitrary powers of the Ordinators, and accuse the Temple hierarchy of self-interest and cor corruption. Well, I fall somewhat along those lines, but, uh, I wouldn't go far to say as... Sorcery can be equated with divine power. It is one or the other. And now I must find this book for the young lady. Alright. So I am in the market for a book. Progress of Truth, yes. I've got to wait for this ordinator. Hey, uh, please leave me alone, creepy mask man. Yes, it's going to be quite difficult, I think. Perhaps I should just pay money for one. Do you sell anything? No? Too bad. How about you? No? Too bad. Hmm. I 
would like this. You could stop looking at me for just a minute. Go away, Balver! Don't you have something better to do with your fancy, so edgy hairstyle, huh? You're just going to stand and look at me, aren't you? Hmm. Hmm. I had my chance. He did turn away. Please leave me. Please leave me. Progress of truth. Progress of truth. Hmm. I need this. Uh oh. Uh oh. Better uh, drop this on the floor. Oh, 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 you caught me. Pay the court 150 gold and surrender your stolen goods. Or surrender your stolen goods and serve your sentence of hard labor. Deliver the gold immediately or come with me. Here's some gold, friends. Ah. Quite a nasty thing. But at least we got my book. Probably for... A bit more than I should have paid. But uh, I, I did save a trip back to Jobasha's. I'm sure she would have been happy to see me again. Mm, I think not, friend. Perhaps we should ask around in the justice offices while we are here. To see if we can help with this criminal that has been ravaging the land. Well, I'm not one for scare tactics of the man that told us about it. I think it should be a, a rather interesting thing to explore. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.